unit. Here we go, number 20. Here can be 1,000. 500 there. 500, how about we get 550 where? I got 7 now. I got 600, 7. 600, 7. How about we get 7, 7, ladies? How about that? How about we get 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, we bought this locker because it's full of everything we're looking for. New vintage. You know, the stuff that's just now coming back into style. Oh my gosh. What is it? Oh, <gasps> what the crap? Damn, it is heavy. Is this a fire alarm? Pull handle down once, let go. I'd love to see how old this is. Oh, look, there's a date. 1924? What? Oh my god, this is where we shine. When people see unwanted, we see must have. Shayna. Look at this. This is like a collectible. Maybe she was into fire. <laughs> this is weird. Oh my gosh. Buddy L quality toys. Look how they spelled Illinois with two L's. Oh, yeah. I think these two go together. I'm going to put them together. OK. OK. This is something we might have to get checked out. Oh my gosh. Is this the whole kit, the fire kit? Elkhart Brass MFG Co. Manufacture the Elkhart. For fire. This, this is the shabby chic dream home. Yes. Girl, we are on fire. Get it? Get it? <laughs> <laughs> I said it, I get it. Oh my gosh, Shane, look at this. No. We are getting our vintage fire stuff checked out by David Steinitz at the Los Angeles Fire Department Historical Society Museum and Memorial. That was a mouthful. So let's see what you've brought for us to take a look at. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, um, hopefully uh, it's still worth the value. <laughs> Oops. This particular model was built by a company called Buddy L. They oh, made, yeah, that's right. We saw it on oh, the front yeah. thing. They that's made fire they truck toys for a long time. This unit's probably 1930s. These toys are rare because they were pre-war. A lot of them were used as scrap. And you're very lucky to have the bell on board because oh. the bells are usually missing. It also has steerable wheels. Oh, I didn't see that. That's so cool. Which actually works. I cannot wait to see what you think of our other goodies we brought. Well, let's take a look. This is a soda acid fire extinguisher. If you needed it, you would turn it upside down, that mixed the chemicals, and then you would fight the fire. This one feels like steel. Yeah. It's not like it's a copper. So if this okay. are cleaned up or polished, it's not going to come out looking as sexy or as beautiful as, as, us. as yeah, some of right. the ones we have here. <laughs> so this is a fire pull box. These were the way you called for the fire department in the very, very early years of this country. And where would they be found? Like on the street? This would be on a street. It would be on a corner within a certain range of houses. The way this works is you pull this lever down and a gearbox inside, yay, you've got the guts. We have the guts! This winds up. <gasps> it so works. What it's doing is it's turning a little wheel that has teeth on it. Okay. And the teeth are broken off in such a way as to produce a number. Oh the wires God. that come out of this would go down into the street and to a building that would have yes. tape machines. So the operator pulls the paper out and reads it. It goes over to a file, pulls out a card that matches that number, and it says, this box is located at the corner of Coenga and Sunset. OK, David, what is everything worth? The pull box, which is in really good shape. It's got the door, it's got the glass, and it's got all the guts. OK. This is worth $175. Ooh, OK. The fire extinguisher, because of its commonality, because it's a steel body, $50. Okay. Now for the best and last piece, yeah. the toy truck. An excellent example of Buddy L product. It's in really good shape. This truck is easily worth $500. That's amazing. That's a lot more than I think we thought. It's saved by the bell. Yeah. You know who's on fire? Us. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. Here we go. I may not have a lot of friends, but I got a lot of money. King of the world!